Welcome to our new microgreen setup. Our previous experience with the window garden microgreens went so well that we decided to grow microgreens at a larger scale. We took the time to look at options for building an inexpensive indoor microgreen setup, and we can't wait to show you what we found. Our past two episodes begin our exploration into microgreens with the unboxing and review of Window Garden Microgreen Starter Kit. If you're completely new to microgreens, we find this to be a very convenient kit to ease your way into growing microgreens. You can find these videos and more by subscribing to our Green Loft Life channel. One YouTube channel which we want to highlight is On The Grow by CJ and Mandy. It's super helpful at educating people on almost anything related to the microgreen growing process. Also, while browsing online forums, we found out a lot of microgreen growers kept mentioning True Leaf Market. True Leaf Market is an amazing resource for growers. What attracted us the most was their hydroponic starter kit. This list gives a clear idea of everything we need. We chose hydroponic since we decided to grow indoors in our garage and did not want to deal with pests or chemical use. In the end, we decided not to get the starter kit. Instead, we looked at building our own setup that would be more cost effective for our microgreens. We searched online and found a great deal at our local Home Depot for only $39.99 for a four level rack at 14 by 36 inches, which meant we could at maximum place eight growing trays on it if we also attached a green light fixture above the top level. Unfortunately, it actually was out of stock, so we had to go with plan B, good old Amazon. We found a similar rack that cost a bit more at $48.99. The only difference was that the one on Amazon had locking wheels, so we are extremely happy about this purchase. Right after we got it, Home Depot got in stock the original rack that we looked at. So if you're not in a rush, be patient and you may be able to catch a better deal. And we just needed T5 LED lights. We grabbed the cheapest we can find, four packs at $59.99 from Amazon. The typical 10 by 20 inch trays without holes to grow hydroponically. We got five of them from Two Leaf Market for around $14. You can find a lot of YouTube channels that talk about how to grow hydroponically by just using a paper towel, which we do plan to experiment with. But we're gonna start by using grow pads. Micromatch Hydroponic Grow Pads has a 4.5 rating on True Leaf Market which gives us confidence that we'll be able to successfully grow something out of it. So altogether, we spent just around $133 on setup. We'll include all the links mentioned in the description below so you can check them out. We purchased our seeds from Amazon a while ago, which included four ounces of radish, four ounces of broccoli, and one pound of wheatgrass, just because we wanted to try to make our own wheatgrass juice, which can be very expensive. In addition, we got this little food scale in order to measure the seeds and final harvest per tray. And we can't wait to start growing. Comment below to let us know what you think about our setup. And please hit the subscribe button to follow our microgreen growing journey.